Hello everyone, how are you? Welcome to this session and I'm Ignatius Asasira. I'm a fourth year medical student at Makele University, uh, specifically in the medical school. I'm a fourth year medical student and I am also the president for the Medical Students Association here in Makele. And I want to take you through uh, a series of talks for you to know what you didn't know about Makele University, what you didn't know about Uganda what you didn't know about the medical school in Uganda, the oldest medical school in Uganda, and that's the Makele University uh, College of Health Sciences. So it was started uh, 97 years ago as a medical school, and um, we have four schools in this college. One of them is the School of Public Health right in our back, whose poster is just here with us. And uh, we have the School of Medicine, where I belong as a student of medicine and surgery. We have the School of Health Sciences, where we have courses like pharmacy and dental surgery. And lastly, we have the School of Biomedical Sciences, where courses like Bachelor of Biomedical Sciences and uh, Bachelor of Biomedical Engineering are pursued. Uh, all these courses are both at uh, undergraduate, postgraduate, fellowship and uh, the PhD level and uh, for those who didn't know uh, this is actually one of the best medical schools you can find on the continent in Africa. The second best as per the 2020 rankings, uh, the second best medical school and why do I talk about all this? It's because you didn't know about it. I won't interest you with who we are and what we offer. Because of our expertise and our experience, we host students from uh, international uh, medical schools and these students come in year after year. We've done this for the last uh, very many years. We have uh, collaborations with different medical schools including the Yale University in the US, uh, in Canada, in Sweden, in Norway to mention but a few and whenever these students come they get their clinical exposure. Like I informed you in the previous video uh, right in the background is the Mulago National Referral Hospital, the training hospital for the medical students here at Makele University. And uh, our curriculum runs in a way that we spend our first two years of medical school doing the basic sciences, the preclinical years. And in our third year, we go for our clinical exposure, where this is one of the hospitals that we visit. And we have two other hospitals, uh, which we go for our clinical experience. Uh, one is the Chiludu National Referral Hospital, where we do our internal medicine rotation. And then the Kawempe National Referral Hospital, where we do our obstetrics and gynecology. So the services which are, uh, the specialty which is right uh, in the building behind us is surgery and pediatrics. And the, the specialties like anesthesia, ophthalmology, the ear, nose and throat. And during these rotations, we get the chance to a clerk patient present to our seniors, a be corrected, manage our patients, and every day of our lives, that's what we do. And then in our fourth year, alongside the clinical exposure, we also have the community placements. In the community placements, what we call COBAs, and we are placed in different communities within the country at the level of a health center one, and there we are able to interact with Ugandans at an individual level, at a family level, at a community level, understand their problems. Come back, report to our seniors, generate solutions together with the policy makers, and go back as medical students in the different communities in the country to implement what you shall have found. And in our fifth year, we complete our medical school uh, by doing the senior clerkship, where we again rotate in the basic, uh, in the four disciplines, that's internal medicine, surgery, pediatrics, and obstetrics and gynecology, together with the specialties like cardiothoracic surgery, urology, um, a trauma surgery, uh, to mention but a few. So medical school in uh, Makele Medical School is basically five years, and after the five years, you now move out as an intern doctor. Internship, you are under the jurisdiction of the Minister of Health, where you are placed in different hospitals in the country to give back to the community for one year. And after that one year, you're given the license to practice as a doctor. Welcome once again. And where we are standing right now is on the main gate of Makele University, 
the main entrance it has three gates and this is the main gate and just to give you a quick preamble of what Makele University is it started as a small vocational and technical institute in the 1922s uh, very many years ago and uh, by then the British government under Mr. Cryan Lobert uh, suggested that I should be uh, we should start up a, a vocational institute so it has grown over the years to become the most and the leading research led uh, university uh, within the region that capitalizes on partnerships with the the government, international scholars and uh, organizations, industry are uh, to mention by a few. Uh, right now, uh, as I'm speaking, we are going to mark 100 years of existence uh, within the next couple of months. That will be next year, in the year 2022, where we shall celebrate and recognize and appreciate the work which this great university has done, not only in Uganda, not only in Africa, but to the rest of the world. We have so many scholars out there. We actually call it the Harvard of Africa. Oh my God, this is very interesting. You don't want to miss to come and associate with the Harvard of Africa. Today we are exploring the faith in our country. Uh, you'll be coming to visit us in Uganda here in Kampala and want to show you that we don't actually stop in academia, but we are all round. We are multi-sectorial, we are multi-social, and uh, our faith is part of the things that define our culture as Africans. Uh, right now where we are standing is the St. Augustine Chapel. That's the Catholic chapel here in Makele University and we are having mass going on already inside later we shall have a small clip of our parishioners uh, celebrating mass and want to assure you all out there that one of the reasons why you want to come and visit us in Africa in Uganda in Makele is because of who we are and what we sell and we cannot stop without showing you part of our faith part of our religion because we are Christians we are Muslims we are believers in Christ and we cannot fail to be proud about who we are so thank you for joining we are going to have a series of talks today uh, so that we you fully um, metabolize for lack of a better word who and what we stand for and who we believe one other extra thing we want to assure you is that in Makele we don't only do the academia and the social life we also have life in the world of sports and Makele University has really uh, ranked so highly as far as sports activities are uh, concerned uh, right in the background uh, is a game one of the games you want to press yourself with and that's tennis uh, currently we are hosting uh, the first two 2021 uh, games that's the international society of university games uh, all over uh, Makele University is hosting both cricket and uh, rugby uh, like you shall see in the other video and you, wa you want to spend your evening hours you want to spend your weekends uh, playing tennis and cricket and table tennis and round tennis and ping pong and volleyball and football and swimming oh my god a number of games and activities here with us so feel free enjoy your stay with me in Makele University enjoy the weather enjoy the scenery this is home sweet home so you may be wondering if I, my hall of residence or my place of residence is uh, in Edge House or at uh, within the main campus, how do I get to the Makele University Medical School, the College of Health Science? I want to make you a quick relation. So where I'm standing right now is within the main campus, where the other colleges are, law, engineering, agriculture, social sciences, to mention but a few. But right across the hill, the buildings you're seeing are close is the Makele University College of Health Sciences. So you will not just be enjoying the walks in the morning and in the evening, but you also be seeing the beautiful places in Wandegea, that's the neighboring place, the neighboring uh, town through which you close to reach the Makele University uh, Medical School. But you can always choose to use a car, you can always use to choose an Uber, you can use to choose an, a safe border. That's at your convenience. Uh, where I'm standing right now is called the Edge House. The Edge House is one of the residences uh, among the other residences where international students, international scholars, professors and doctors who visit us at Makele University, at Makele Medical School have their uh, residence houses. So uh, this is called the Edge House. It has been hosting our students for the last very many years. And um, I want to take you through the journey of when you reach uh, at the airport in Uganda, what happened. So the international airport in Uganda is called Entebbe in here in Kampala. And when you arrive, there will be a van waiting for you to pick you up and your luggage. And from the van, uh, from the airport, the van will drop you to one of the residences 
where Edge House is hap happens to be one of the uh, residences, and you'll be welcome. You'll be uh, well uh, re received. The hospitality here is enormous, uh, and this happens always ahead of time. We always inform uh, the house um, owners and the different residences uh, in the other locations about your coming. So they are always prepared to receive you. And us as the global buddies, the student buddies, the global friends, will come and pick you from one of these residences and show you around the geography of Makela University. We shall take you uh, in the different colleges, uh, the engineering school, the law school, the medical school. We shall take you to the hospital in Mulago where we practice our clinical practice. We take you to the markets and the, uh, the churches around, including the smaller communities where our neighbors all are, and the supermarkets and uh, the places where you do your grocery from. Uh, if you want to get an African or Ugandan line, You'll, we shall always guide you to so that you can keep in touch with your people back at home. So this is the Edge House. Feel free to uh, enjoy the, the scenery and let's keep in touch. Peace